Hello and welcome to my channel. Uh, today I'm going to be trying on these press-on nails from a company called Vanity Bay. Um, I was contacted and they said would I like to try them out and show them on my channel and I said yes. So the first ones are these. It's probably best just to show you through the front at first. They're very pretty. The second one, and these are the ones I'm going to pop on. And then the third ones are like a, a matte pink. So we'll just put those two aside for now. We'll have a look. It says 24 reusable nails. Choose your best fit between 24 nails. So they've got plenty of choices. And use them as many times as you want. High quality instant manicure glue and glue tabs are included. So that's excellent. They're giving you a choice. You can have the glue, which I prefer. Or if you're not wanting something so permanent, you can use the tabs and peel them off. Right, there's a little alcohol pad to cleanse your nails first and make sure there's no oils on there. So that's good as well. I'm just looking for... The, there we go. So we've got a little stick to push back the cuticles and some tabs. These are great if you just want the nails on for a night and you've got work in the morning or something because you can just peel them off afterwards it makes it a lot easier. But I am going on with the glue so I'll try this little glue out. Let's have a look. I think I've got to cut the end off. It looks sealed to me. So I'm just going to prep these first. So the first thing I'm going to do is you just get this little stick here and you're just pushing your cuticles back all the way along. Now I would normally do all this with my e-file but as I'm testing out a product um, I'm going to use all the bits and pieces that come with the product so you can see the end result as, as though you were using them all. So I'm just going along here and just making sure I can get that nail tucked nicely into the cuticle. Can you see how I can just, if you look at the point there, the point can just sort of disappear under there a little bit. So that means I can tuck the nail in and it'll look more natural. So I'm just gonna do that with all of these nails, just pushing back the cuticle gently. I'm not doing it hard. And then I'll just get the point and I can just see how far in I'm going. So I'll do that with all of my nails. Okay, that's all done. I've done the cuticles and they give you this little um, mini emery board. So that's just to sort of shorten your nails a little bit because you don't want your nails showing underneath this, the press on nails. So I'll just bring them down to a nice length, mine are short anyway. And then we'll open up this little pad. And this is a little alcohol pad that she's popped in the kit. So you've got everything you need. And then I'm just rubbing around the cuticle and my nails to make sure everything's nice and hygienic and clean. Like that. And that'll dry everything off as well. And then it's just a matter of uh, finding the right sizes. So as you can see, I picked this one. Um, does it have a name? You have to go on the website and see if you can find it. But it's got like a pearle pearlescent, neutrally nude. And then it's got a bright pink for the French part. I'm just going to get my clippers because there's just a little bit of a nub here. I'm just going to take that off. Like that. And then that fits. Now I have a, just to give you an idea, I have a wide thumb 
and that fits edge to edge so they've got uh, the right sizes for everybody. So we'll just try sliding that down on that nail and that looks quite nice I think. We'll get some glue. So I'll just put glue over my nail. Pop that back on. And I'll wear these until they start to loosen so you can get an idea of how long they'll stay on for as well because it's all dependent on the glue and how it, it matches with the, the nail. But that's a really comfortable nail, very pretty. And I asked for short sure, because I've got things to do at the moment. But I will try, if, if, they, uh, if they want to send me more, I will try the long ones. So that's the first one done. I'll get these done. That was how easy it was to pop them on. This is the next nail. And you can see how it just slides, slides on beautifully. I don't have to press it down to make it fit. If you press it down, it means that in time it'll just pop up. It's more likely to come off the hand. So it's much nicer if you go for a quality nail like this, that's not too curved, and then it'll just slide onto the nail like that. So there we go, I've popped them on. They went on extremely easy and very fast, and the glue seems to be holding okay. So um, I will do my other hand, and then we'll just do a wear test. So I won't sort of put this video out right now, I'll um, just wear them throughout the week, hopefully two, that would make it good value, and um, I'll give my opinion at the end. Hello, just an update now, um, I've had these on a week, they've been swimming and um, cleaning, I lost the thumb, but that was my fault because I was bathing my bulldog, my, my bull mastiff rather, and she's really really big, so yeah, she was coming up on me, giving me lots of loving and my nail popped off. But these, there's no wearing that, you know, the edges and they're all still firmly on. And what I like about them is, I don't know if you can see, but look how slim that is. It's not a thick nail. So yeah, these are really good. I recommend you try them. And you can see there a little bit of growth but yeah they look good I recommend them